Terrytown Travel Center, the RV Superstore. This is John coming at you from Terrytown RV in Grand Rapids, Michigan on a beautiful sunny afternoon. And I just wanted to take some time to show you this brand new Jayco Hummingbird 17RB. Uh, I already put two of the other Jayco Hummingbirds uh, on YouTube, but we just got this one in. Our people haven't even had time to clean it up yet or anything, but I wanted to get a video of it really quick because of the amount of watches we've had on our other two, because there's obviously a lot of interest in these Hummingbirds. And I heard that from the salespeople as well. But also I, I was just excited to to get a look at it because I haven't seen this one yet. So uh, the 17RB is a rear bathroom unit and it has a larger sized rear bathroom. Uh, it does have a single slide out like one of the other hummingbirds, but the bathroom is in the back. Yeah, it doesn't actually have too much of an effect on the inside, but uh, I'll show you that when we get to that. So like the other hummingbirds, uh, it is laminated. It has a one piece roof. Um, same sleek look, same LED light strip and power awning uh, that I've actually put out a little bit here. It's not all the way out uh, because the other units on the lot where they have this parked right now. But yeah, it has the, the diamond plating in the front and in the back. Uh, it has, these are actually blue LED lights. I did not turn them on right at this moment. There's also a little utility bay in the front where you can put your propane tank, put a battery. This one does not have a power lift on it. Um, it actually does come with a bike rack, um, and this is the bike rack spot where you hook that up at. But here, I'll show you. I did have another question on the other video, um, what kind of bike rack it was. Right here, it's from Lippert Components. So this is the box for it. It's inside here. You can see it. It's called the bike wing. You can check that out on their website as well. This is uh, a storage compartment. It is quite large, as you can see, and it does have an LED light inside. All right, also you're gonna have some pretty large UV windows, uh, pretty large, especially, especially relative to the size. All of these hummingbirds do come with these really attractive aluminum wheels, a really attractive graphics package. I think one reason why they're successful is because They've managed to put a lot of really great features in a really cool looking package that's compact, easy to tow. Here it comes with four stabilizer jacks as well. Well, I'm looking at that. But it's compact, easy to tow. Uh, it has the same build quality as the other Jayco products. So it's got screwed and glued cabinetry. It's really well made. Um, it's at a good price point, but it's just got a ton of attractive features and attractive looks. Uh, it's quite eye-catching, so just got a lot of what people want. All right, this is an indoor-outdoor shower. Um, this is where you put your cable TV. This is where you hook it up to regular power if you're at a campsite. Here's the other side profile. So let's uh, go on in and check out this 17RB from the inside. Here, and before we go inside, I just want to show you this. Here's the logo again, 17RB. That's got the tough shell aluminum frame. And it's a Jayco product, so it has a really great two-year manufacturer's warranty. Here's your aluminum step with the grip tape, doorway, entrance handle. As we step inside the 17RB, you can see that it has a lot of features that are similar to the other two. Uh, we've got the same wood-look vinyl flooring. It's going to hold up well the foot traffic and dirt. We've got, this one comes with copper cloth decor, but it has a dining table here that will fold down into a bed. Um, here's part of that decor. It's got some storage cabinets to the right. It's got a bed in the back, a kitchenette here on the left. But the difference is that when you walk in, there's a large bathroom here. Whereas the rear kitchen unit has the kitchen in the back, this one has a bathroom in the back, and, uh, and the other two feature the bathroom kind of right here to the right of the door. Okay, so let's check out what's the same first. Check out this bed in the back. Got a window on both sides. This is pretty much the same in all of these units. Uh, let's get a look at this mattress. All right, there's a little cubby hole underneath the mattress. There's gonna be a USB power plug. Um, there's gonna be HDMI for your TV hookup. Uh, there's a little cargo net here. Here's our remote for controlling the LED awning, which is pretty cool. It has a ton of different combinations you can do. 
All of these come with these great blinds that pull down. These are the same blinds that are in the more expensive fifth wheels. Bunch of overhead storage here. This is made by Jayco. It has the shadow glass and real screwed and glued cabinetry. So lots of storage space for a little unit like this. Some speakers on the ceiling. There's an air conditioning unit on the ceiling, which is actually an upgrade for this unit, but this particular one has it. Uh, here's the multimedia player. It has USB. You can control the speakers outside. You can control the speakers inside, which is pretty cool. The dinette again, which I said you can fold into a bed. And here's the wood panel front refrigerator. This is going to be gas and electric. Let's get a look at that. Good sized refridge for such a, or good sized fridge, which is a small unit. Uh, this does not have an oven, but it does have a convection microwave oven, which is also a pretty good size, especially for something so small as this. Okay, you can see the wood look fascia on the slide out. Another utility tool here. We've got a, a hanging bar and some hooks. All right, we've got more storage above the kitchen. A surprising amount of countertop space here. A two range cooktop. Right here we have our sink and our faucet um, with some more storage underneath that as well. Oh, and there's also storage underneath these, if you're wondering. So you can pull up those, pull this up. See that there? Move very easy. Also, uh, I want to note that the ceiling is plenty tall in here. I'm six foot one and I can easily walk around in here, uh, which is nice. Obviously, you don't want to feel crammed, especially with a small unit like this. You want it to be small, you want it to be easy to tow, but you don't want it to be uncomfortable. Okay, before we go in the bathroom, this is the last thing. This is a table that comes with all of these hummingbirds. Uh, they all come with a spot for it too, which is a really smart design by Jayco. So no matter where you go, you can take this, put it right outside underneath your awning, and you're good to go. So let's open up this rear bathroom. So this is a large rear bathroom. Here are the hooks on the door. It's surprisingly big. They did a good job uh, engineering the layout of this unit. There's a large mirrored medicine cabinet slash linen cabinet here. A foot flush toilet. Large cargo net. Spot for your toilet paper. Here is the bathroom sink. You even have a little bit of storage space underneath that. Another hook here. And here's the shower. The shower head is on the ground. I think they usually do that for transportation. Because like I said, our people haven't even had time to clean this out yet. So straight from the manufacturer. I'm gonna get back so you can see this. See how large this bathroom actually seems. And personally, I don't know if I were going to buy any of these, which I think they're really cool because they're kind of like a small motor home, but a lot cheaper and you can tow them with your car. I don't know if I would pick this one. I like that it has the big bathroom because the other ones, it is kind of strange to have a bathroom or to have a shower and a toilet in one little closeted room together. But I think I might like the, the space, especially in the rear kitchen one better. I'm not sure though, I do like this design as well. It would be really hard for me to choose if I were to buy one of these. Here's your entrance again, and I did wanna show you that once you come in, uh, there are a few on-off switches for all your lights. Uh, here's where you control your utilities, your slide room, and your awning. So yeah, this has been a brand new 2017 Jayco Hummingbird 17RB, and the RB stands for Rear Bathroom. Uh, if you have any more questions, you wanna see this unit or any other Jayco units, there really any other units of any kind. We have pretty much everything here at Terrytown and Motorhomes to Go is right next to us. So feel free to uh, give us a call or an email or come on down to Terrytown anytime and, and we'll be happy to help you out. So yeah, take care. Give Terrytown RV a call today so we can put our buying power and experienced service to work for you. We look forward to earning your business. Terrytown RV. Don't forget to like comment, and subscribe to our YouTube page to stay updated on new content. Our Facebook link and websites are located in the descriptions below. Terrytown RV.